What's happening everybody? It's Dwayne with Off Grit. I'm actually doing some snowshoeing here in Flagstaff. Now the funny thing is, most people, this is like a getaway to be off grid, be away from things. In fact, where I'm at here, they uh, sell little, you know, um, yurts where they're not, where they, you know, do camping here. It's all off grid. And of course for us, you know, we live that lifestyle now all the time. So coming out here, this is more of like a vacation away from it. So, well, we wanted to keep some good uh, physical exercise. So you see, I got my dogs behind me here and it's snowing. So, uh, yeah, just taking a few days off just to get away from the same old, same old. And um, I actually have to go back and pick up some solar panels on the way back at Santan Solar. And let's see, I got 70 panels. So uh, I paid like 25 bucks a panel um, plus the you know, cost of getting them. Just taking a U-Haul back from there. She's going to drop me off. My wife's going to drop me off in Phoenix. I'm going to pick up a U-Haul and just take it back. So we just figured we might as well make it a round trip because it's already quite a trip for us to get up there anyways to pick the panels up and I wanted to make it worth our while. So um, yeah, so we came up to Flagstaff. Got to enjoy uh, the Grand Canyon. I actually haven't been to the Grand Canyon. Uh, it's been in Arizona 25 plus years. Hadn't been there. So I finally got to make it up there. You know, so it's cool. I still, it's still not the Grand Canyon trip I actually want to do. Um, eventually, I'd like to do the real Grand Canyon trip, but I've been saying that for 20 years. But, but yeah, so, you know, it's a nice little exercise here. You can see I got my snowshoes on. And uh, it's nice, easy, easy walk in here. Get some steps in. Just, you know, staying active. That's really the key for me at this point you know in life it's just um you know i used to be in sports a lot so i, I like to, i like always being active you know um except for now i don't really like doing things too crazy so i find snowshoeing i would have done cross country but i have the dogs um but uh you know with the dogs here it's a little easier just to do with these but uh, anyways just thought i'd show you guys what we what i've been up to here for the last week um really just it's nice to get a break from it you know um, because when you live on that you know off the grid and you're building a house and building a homestead the stuff never leaves you it's always there 24 7 and so sometimes it feels like you really can't ever get away from it and you know you'll feel trapped once in a while so just for advice for somebody when you get anything out of a video like this it's just that you do need to take breaks even if your breaks include doing physical things just a break being like just do something different than what you're doing um, i find that it refreshes me i need to go back and i'll have a little clearer head i'm able to get some distance away from some of the problems or issues that i gotta work out and then i gotta go back with a fresh mind and i go okay now i got a clear head i can rethink this or i can you know forward with what I was doing or whatever so because when I get back I got a lot of stuff I gotta do. Um, it's really starting to get to be spring now and it's gonna be warmer so I gotta get all this concrete work done. It's just like concrete, concrete, concrete. It's really all I've been thinking about. Then I gotta put up that uh, carport, solar carport, which will be my biggest welding project to date by the way. It's the biggest project I've ever done. It'll be 800 square foot uh, carport with 56 panels on it and uh, all trusses, all steel, everything's welded, some bolts in there, but mostly welds. It's going to be pretty big for me, so uh, I'm pretty looking forward to it, although there are a lot of logistics you got to work out when you're doing it solo. So this was a good break for me to just kind of take a break from it because, uh, like I said, when I go back, I got nothing but problems. So uh, anyways, hope everybody's doing well. Hope you enjoy the scenery here. Um, pretty much by myself, my wife's behind me a bit here, but uh, it's been nice. Over and out.